So you were scammed. Can you mention the, the agency's names that you feel scammed you and how much money in total? Well, uh, about the money, it was a lot of money. I don't, uh, I didn't uh, make a calculation, but uh, it was about uh, 1,000 and more dollars for a month. And I was speaking for a few months. Let's say hello to Sassoon, who was scammed by Anastasia Date. And uh, what's the other? Well, let's, let's ask him. Hello, Sassoon. Hello. Welcome. Good How are you? you? Fabulous. How are you doing? I'm fine, fine. <laughs> Thank Good. you. You're in Israel, yeah? Yes. yes. Okay, well, first of all, thanks very much for, you know, bearing your soul today. It's very brave of you um, to, to talk about what's happened. It really is paying it forward and helping our viewers today understand this craziness of scams and how we get sucked into them. So, yeah, I just want to thank you on behalf of everybody. Thank you. Welcome, welcome. So you were scammed. Can you mention the, the agency's names that you feel scammed you and how much money well, in total? Well, uh, about the money, it was a lot of money. I, don't, uh, I didn't uh, make a calculation, but uh, it was about uh, 1,000 and more dollars for a month. And I was speaking for a few months. And um, it was Anastasia and um, a lady that, and uh, actually the, 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 the girls are waiting uh, for you to speak with them and they, they have the same method. They, uh, they want to know you better and they want to... Um, to get to know you better, and uh, they speak about everything. They Can know I just to... clarify before we get started? Um, so you were scammed by AnastasiaDate.com and Golden Brides. It says Golden in my notes about $15,000. Yes, yes. Is that all sound Gold... about right? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, just want to establish it before you tell your story. So please, if you could, um, maybe let me ask you a question. How did you get started chatting with these girls on Anastasia and Golden Brides? Well, I was uh, looking for a, an Ukrainian woman or a um, beautiful woman <laughs> and uh, younger than I. And, uh, you know, the woman of my dreams. And I started to look for uh, some sites. Then I got in and then I started to talk with someone that I liked. And uh, it, it, it comes, it's like a snowball, you know? You get into the conversations and it's going on and on and you're starting to like more the girl. She know how to turn you on with the speaking and uh, you get into it. And you're starting to get addicted to the, to the site and to the girl. And uh, why do you, let me ask you, why do you think that is? Where, wh what's that addictive drawback that you got to go check your um, email, well, and check for pictures? Why do you think that is for you? First of all, like I said, I, I'm looking the the woman of my dream, and uh, you know sometimes uh, you are dreaming too much, <laughs> and um, and you you get to, the to know the girl you you want you like. And uh, they they just prof professional. They don't. They know how to speak with you to bring you to the things that you want. And actually, you, you they looking for. They know you are lonely, and you want the conversation, and you want the you want them, and they know how to to uh, to fish you, my to fish you like a fish. And uh, you hear me. Hello? Yeah, I'm here. I'm just putting you on full camera while, while you are got the floor. Ah, okay. I'm here. I'm here. Yeah, please continue. So, the, so they are like uh, fishing you very nicely. And uh, you, you, you think it's, 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 it's the truth. You, you think it's, it's going to be good. You think it's, it's going to be, you think it's real. It's going to be real. And actually it's... Uh, you get into it. 
like addicted and they know how to to turn you for that what they want and um, also uh, the girl also uh, give you the hope that she will soon uh, will give you her uh, her um, personal uh, Uh, phone or to connect you personally but it's uh, it's getting they, they they take it more long and more long and you don't see it and actually one of the these girls also gave me um, an email and phone Her number email address yeah she gave you mm-hmm. and, and yes and and the phone number also and she started to talk with me a little bit by email send me some photos some talkings but it was not uh, uh, was uh, you know um, it was not always so I have to go to the site to ask her why she don't try to me and she, oh yeah I, I lost my uh, my uh, my computer and uh, or it balked and um, I don't have it now I will uh, buy a new one. Maybe you will send me some money. And uh, that's it. That's how it goes. And, and let me just add, Sasan, that they're, they're very well trained at this. They just hook you in, keep you hooked by saying, here's my email, maybe even my phone number. We can connect. But you know what? It's always an excuse why she can't continue. She'll send you a few correspondences by email. SMS on WhatsApp or by email, but then very quickly, ah, oh, it's more convenient using the translator on the site for me. Yes, 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 of course, yes, yeah. correct. Here's a question. Correct. Let's take a question. Um, Info Seeker is just asking this. He says, why can you not ask the agency for her direct contact if they give it to you well, then? I think- well, they, they, they say mm-hmm. you need to, to uh, talk uh, with her for a while, and uh, if she decides... That it's the time for her to to contact you personally then she will give you the the permission so you can ask some in some site if you can ask the 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 address but she will not uh, she will refuse because she say she it's not the time yet she wants to know you more but more good and you guys you need to uh, Alan and guys watching that's a huge red flag that this is You know, just a huge, huge red flag. I need to know you better. What, well, you can chat with me on WhatsApp for free. To, yes, to yes that's what I better. say, but she said she's not for me. But they say it all the time. So thanks for the question, Alan. And guys, please make this interactive. Please um, ask Sasan any question as it relates to you. If you've chatted or you're chatting now online, this live stream is for you guys that are actively being scammed. You have the hindsight of a gentleman here that's being so brave and willing to, you know, let, his, let it all hang out, you know. Um, so ask your questions. There's no such thing as a foolish question. So please, um, yeah. Um, here's here's a, a, a comment or a question. Um, ask 2,000 credits. Ask for details. Uh, gives you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So... Let me ask you, what age of ladies, first of all, how old are you and what age of ladies were you chatting with on these sites? I'm 54 and uh, I chat with uh, uh, 35, 32, 30, actually with three girls, um, everyone in, uh, not in the same time, yes, but mm-hmm. uh, uh, there was... Uh, Pretty and young, because I like children and I want more children. And, um, and uh, I, th- I think it's a, it's a good age. Uh, this is the, the ages I speak with. Well, um, do, you, do you want my professional comment or advice, Sassu? Yes, of course. Are you course. still on this journey? Are you still looking for a Ukrainian wife? Uh, actually, yes. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Are you, are you actively looking anywhere or, or not active right now? I'm, 
a little bit active, not like before, but I don't uh, think, uh, I think to, to leave it because uh, all the sites are not, uh, all, they're all the same, actually. I noticed it's all the same. They all want uh, only the money. Have you tried us yet? Have you tried Met Guarantee? I don't know. Uh, not, not yet. <laughs> not not yet. yet because, uh, you know, I was also uh, um, uh, offended from the other side. So it's very, I don't, I'm not so uh, convenient now. Once bitten, twice shy, we say. Yeah, it's, uh, yeah. it makes one skeptical, and I, I certainly understand. I mean, you come through this process um, jaded and tainted. Unfortunately, that's the byproduct of, of being scammed like this, which is hard for you to trust again because your trust was stamp stumbled upon. And just so you know, how our processes at Match Guarantee, because we've never spoken before, is that you get to take us for a test drive. It only costs you a donation of your choice to our Ukraine Refugee Fund. And that entitles you to choose 10 ladies from our website and basically invite them out. So we send your photos, your intro letter. And from those 10, you get to see how many are interested in you back. And that right there is your best litmus test to see how realistic you are. What are your expectations in terms of age gap and beauty? Are they realistic? For example, if you get zero or one that says yes back to you, you know you're out to lunch in the real world, right? Yes. But yes. if you get three, four, five, you're good. You know, you're, you know your expectations are realistic. And, and then from the ladies that reply to you that uh, like you back, you get to choose one and have a Zoom video call with her with a translator on the line. And this is designed so that you will feel what a, a good traditional Ukrainian woman is like, and you might have a good connection with her. Uh, and then this equips you with a good gut feeling to make a decision to join Match Guarantee or not. Does yes. that make sense? Yeah. Yes. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, um, yeah, I mean, in terms of... I was going to offer you my feedback in terms of age gap for you. I understand where you're at if you want children. Um, I was in the very same boat when I came to Ukraine. I was age 50. And that was my life's dream is to be a dad because I, I, I had never had children. So I was looking for single moms. And as you see, it turned out well for me. Uh, I'm, I'm married to my soulmate and we have a four-year-old and a 10-year-old that love me like their dad. So it, it's great. It's possible. Um, I would just... And my advice to you would just be, you got to know what are the source of the ladies? Where does, whatever agency you're going to wor work with, where do they get their ladies from? That's the big question. Are, in other words, are they quality ladies? And that's a whole big topic in of itself. Um, okay, so um, back, to, back to it. I guess, um, you know, Sasan, if you could rewind the clock and go back and talk to yourself before you started this journey of chatting online with ladies, what would be the three top pieces of advice you would give yourself? That's a question for you. Oh, not to go to these sites because they're using you only for money, actually. Actually, you don't know uh, behind who is really with you because... They don't want to speak with the camera. Most most of them don't want to speak with the camera. And uh, one of the girls that I was speaking with, I, I noticed um, after a while that sometimes in the camera that it's the it's like the picture repeat itself. It's 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 like it's recorded. Yeah, they they are recorded. They're on they're on because loop. because they don't they don't speak with you. They only write with you, and so you see them in the in the video. Yeah, you but just see them don't... on the keyboard, right? Chatting. Yes, yes, yes. Or, they do, but... or you might not even. Yeah, it, yes, the, but... the video chatting is a scam. The the paper letters a scam. The chats a scam. The whole fucking thing is a scam. The whole. Thing. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. yeah. So, guys, any questions for us so soon? Um, so you wouldn't you wouldn't go to the sites. It's one piece of advice. So, what would you do? How would you go find? How would you find her if you could rewind the clock and have the the wisdom that you have now? 
Well, okay. now, the, now uh, unfortunately, the, there is a war in Ukraine, so I cannot go to Ukraine. I think it's also, maybe it's the best way to do it. But uh, if you have somebody, some, somebody who can uh, um, give you the, the, how can I say it, uh, uh, the safety that you are uh, uh, treating well with the, uh, I don't. I don't find the the right uh, <laughs> words for it. Uh, some someone that you can trust that give you the the right woman. Yeah, exactly. You, you've got to know somehow um, the quality of the woman that you're meeting somehow or another. Yes, or yes. As, as some advice in there, go to Europe. The thing is to just fly to Europe, uh, unless unless you're a free man and you don't have to work or you work online, that, that's a very long process. It takes a lot of time. It yes. can work, absolutely. Um, okay, so that's two pieces of advice. What would be your third uh, piece of advice, one more piece of advice, if you talk to your former self? <laughs> it's very hard. Oh, very while you're hard. thinking, here's another guy, Janik. He says, I saw pre-recorded videos on, on PicBride. Oh, on PicBride. I thought he said... Ah, Golden Brides. Here's pre-recorded experience videos on Golden Brides. So here's the fellow. Yeah, he also had the pre-recorded videos on Golden Brides. Yes, like yes. You. If, you, if, you, if you see it a few times, you can see after day after day or or something like that, you can see it's the same like it was before. She, she wore the same dress, the same place, the same movements. Yeah, yeah. If you can get to notes that. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. So I don't know. Um, any thoughts of other pieces of, of advice? Um, I don't have. No. No? Okay. <laughs> okay. So can, maybe any, any other, any, anything else you want to add about your story about being scammed by... Uh, by Golden Brides or Anastasia Date? Well, I said that they're all uh, using the same method and uh, they all uh, make uh, scams, but um, you need to check this. I don't know how to do it, but um, I, I saw you in, uh, on YouTube and I, I got to notice that you have also uh, this program and uh, the the site that you have, um, so it's it's it sounds more um, reliable. But I'm still uh, afraid, you know. Yeah, that's un that's the unfortunate byproduct of being a victim, right? Victims are yeah. always afraid next time because yes, yes, that's a given, right? You were just screwed over, so it's, <laughs> yes. it doesn't bode for trusting the next time, right? But somehow yes. you have to get over that fear get over that hump right so i think yeah. next time you'll be diligent you'll whoever you're going to work with you'll check them out extensively one tip is um these agencies they hire reputation management firms for example like the big boys they spend millions and what these reputation management firms do they bury all the negative reviews to page four page five of google so if you want to find the truth when you google anastasia reviews Go to page two, page three, page four, page five, page ten, and that's where you'll find the good, the goods, the truth on them, on whatever the website it is. Yeah. Um, what was it gonna add? Uh, that yeah, guys, from the last video. So you've I, I've I've told you about my dirty old man hack before and this is where you get to have some fun and you just bust them at their game so go to any of these notorious scam sites any of these right here okay for example these ones here or these ones here right um and this is the whole list right this is the whole list let me go through the whole list so it's well, actually let me go through it slowly um uh, what you do is you register at any of these sites and you list yourself as about 65 years of age, no photos, and you put graphic sexual stuff, 
in there of what you want to do. Um, have fun with it. And, and then you'll see as soon as you finish registering, you get just inundated with 19, 20, 20. Well, most of them are like 20, 21, 22, 25 hotties that want to date this dirty old man, right? You clearly set yourself out as the dirty old man with no photo. And busted, right? You get 20, 30 replies within the first day, usually much more than that. And so if you just go through that procedure on whatever site you're chatting on now, what more evidence do you need, right? Yes. Yes. Well, Sassoon, thank you very much for sharing your story today. <laughs> thank you. Thank you for joining us. Bye now.